All right, let's begin. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of It's All Relative. Today, we are not going to be going out because basically, Pokemon Go has already released a statement saying that Abra Community Day has been postponed to, well, I'm not sure when, so they didn't really say. But instead, what they're going to do is that they're going, they provided us like some kind of uh, box or something. Uh, that gives us 30 incense because the coronavirus thing is getting a little bit crazy right now so yeah people should stay at home you know isolate yourself uh, don't go into crowded places and if you're gonna play Pokemon what you can do instead you can play PvP which we're gonna be doing that in this episode but before that here's what I'm gonna update you guys okay so um, last week when I uploaded my last episode regarding the shiny I can't remember what's the shiny already Oh right, it was about hunting that Darkrai and stuff. I did not get a shiny Darkrai. But what happened was that after I uploaded that episode and I went out for dinner, I found this shiny. I found this shiny, a shiny Scorapi. Scorapi? I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, yeah, I was so surprised because quite frankly, uh, there was the last day and Scorapi's spawn rate was quite low. So for me to find a shiny Scorapi was... It was like... <clears throat> Perfect way to end the event. Uh, but then the day after that, I found another shiny as well, and this was a shiny Alolan Rattata. Now, I have a shiny Alolan Rattata before, but you know, never hurt to get more, you know, that's what I'm saying. Then after that, I think that it was like two days later, I went for a run, and then a couple of 10Ks hatched, and we hatched two brand new Pokemon. One of them is Ordino, and the other one is Archon. So I did not know Archon was gonna be the pool. I did not know that Ordino was gonna be the pool of 10KM eggs, but they are, and they are not shiny, but you know, they are Pokedex entry, which I'm very excited about. So, as you can see here, we have a Scorapi right here, a shiny one, oh, love it. A shiny Rattata, shiny Alolan Rattata, in fact. And we have an Ordinal and an Archon. Unfortunately, their CP is not that great, but hey, you know, still good enough. Alright, so here's what we're going to do, guys. Because there's not really not much for me to go out and like hunt and stuff. I know they are like fighting type Pokemon spawning and stuff, but I'm trying to limit myself from actually going out too much, especially on weekends, because there's a lot of people out there. Well, some people out there. So what we're going to do is something we've never done in this episode, uh, never done in this channel. In fact, we never actually done a Go Battle series. So if you guys want to see more of this Go Battle series and stuff, do let me know. But this will be the first one. I recently already did one uh, one set, which is from level 1 to level 2. Is that what you call it? Rank 1 to rank 2 or something? So, let's try to get our rank 2 to rank 3 with 5 battles in a row and see if we can you know, level up. There's like basic rewards and premium rewards and stuff, depending on which one you pick and stuff. I think we're just going to go with the basic, right? Um, yeah, because why not? So, we can only pick Great League here. I'm not sure why I cannot pick Ultra League or Master League. I think it's because I never participated during before the season 1. That's kind of my fault. But here it is. I actually have a team of Azumarill, uh, Alteria, and a Scizor. So the Scizor is a funny one because I don't really see a lot of people running Scizor, but I was thinking that it would be kind of interesting to put a bug into our team, right? And the only downside for this team is that I would think it's Rock-type. Rock-type would kill this team, I think, unless my Azumarill doesn't die, you know? But here we go. Let's give it a try. All right, Radic, 1-3, 1-3, 1-3, 1-3. Good luck to you, right? Good luck to you. This is us actually staying at home and playing Pokemon Go. Uh, we're not supposed to be doing that, we're supposed to be going out and stuff. Alright, so Azumarill versus an Abama Snow. I've never seen an Abama Snow in this rank before, so I think I'm most likely gonna die. I need to get that play rough out because holy crap, I am taking a lot of damage, guys. Okay, I don't know if I made the right call to swap out, but maybe I did, I'm not sure. Okay, we're gonna protect because if he has Stone Edge, I think he does. Does he have Stone Edge? Energy Ball. Wait, I'm not sure if Abana Snow even has Stone Edge, in fact. <laughs> well, it's okay. Okay, I think he's gonna block. Yep. But I think my Dragon Breath should be able to take him down quite quickly. Yeah, I think, I think I'll just farm him down. Okay, cool. Dragon Breath, very powerful in Altaria, guys. So, we're gonna farm a bit. Okay, so good. Uh, Primate is weak against Sky Attack, so if he doesn't block this, he's definitely gonna die. So, he's definitely gonna block, yep. Alright, and that leaves me open. Yeah, I'm gonna block this again, because uh, we wanna take down the Primate as fast as we can, then we can basically have 3 on 1 with the last Pokemon, if it doesn't kill my Altaria, yeah. Okay, yep. Alright, they should be able to take it down. 
All right, we missed the bubble. Let's get this guy attacked. Weak connection. Hopefully that doesn't affect my game. Mill tank. Okay, that's an interesting choice. It's okay. We're gonna still use sky attack to spam him down. Okay, we should be able to take him down. Like, uh, unless he has some kind of move set that's gonna kill us. But yeah, you guys can see the Altaria with uh, Dragon Breath is just ridiculous, ridiculous DPS, man. Ice Beam. Okay. All right. So with Ice Beam, I think Azumarill should be able to take the uh, take the job. Yeah. We play rough. Okay, that's game one, guys. I haven't actually showed my Scizor yet uh, because I do know that sometimes they will use like Psychic Pokemon, and actually Scizor is very powerful against that since the Bug type, right? Uh, all right, so next battle. Do let me know if any of you guys actually managed to climb up to like rank ten or something. I heard it's actually quite difficult. So I have never actually tried Go Battle as much. I'm so sorry, guys, but. Uh, I'll do my best. I'll do my best. Okay, so we have Registeel here against the Azumarill. Uh, I think Ice Beam should be able to take it down if it doesn't block. I know there's a lot of people... Okay. Um, do I want to block? Do I want to block? I'll just block it. Flash Cannon. Okay, I'll just use Ice Beam. So a lot of people is actually using... Um, Registeel, because Registeel obviously is a very very tanky Pokemon. Okay, I forgot that Ice Beam doesn't do much. And Gardevoir, of course. Okay, after this we're gonna swap out to our Scizor because... Because... yep. So, Scizor should be able to take it down quite quickly because with X Scissor. But then again, my Scizor is actually dying quite fast too, so maybe I might not be able to use Scizor as much. Okay, wow, I'm dying. I'm dying really quickly. I think I'm on the block. Because I want to take out this Gardevoir. With my x Scissor. If it doesn't kill me. First, holy shit, it killed me. Okay, uh... This is not good because Gardevoir is actually resisting against the Dragon Breath, so since it's fairy, so yeah, we're gonna use uh, we're gonna use Azumarill to take it down with Bubble. Okay, all right. So hopefully the next one doesn't give me any trouble. Okay, what do you have? What do you have? Azumarill as well. Holy shit! Okay, I have to use Ice Beam here because uh, play rough. I don't think it would do much damage. Yeah, still not effective. Okay, we're gonna swap it up. If he has Ice Beam, I'm kinda screwed. Please don't have Ice Beam, please don't have Ice Beam. Okay, play rough. Oh wow, I, I forgot Azumarill is... Okay, we're gonna lose guys, because Azumarill is actually really strong. Since it's a fairy type and my dragon type Pokemon is just gonna get slaughtered here. So I think second game, definitely not in our favor guys and we still have to deal with a registry oh my god this is ridiculous guys okay it's okay we'll we'll try our best we'll try our best i think my scissor thing was giving me problem i might have to switch it out to something else later but yeah in the meantime i can't really do much right now Okay, yep, Azumarill versus Azumarill. Yeah, okay. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Okay, let's move on to the next one. I'm still not very comfortable with my Scizor yet, but I'm gonna keep trying him for a couple more rounds. Uh, if it doesn't work out, I'm also gonna switch, uh, swap him out to something else. Uh, we'll see, we'll see. I really want to incorporate a Bug type into my team because I feel like a Bug type can do wonders on certain lineups, but not sure about this. Okay, so Medicham. Medicham, I'm not sure if Play Rough can do much damage. Uh, yeah, okay, wow.
So I guess we're battling out between Azumarill and Azumarill. So if I play this right, I should be able to have the upper hand in the end because I do have uh, more shields in the end. I might have to swap it out a bit later, but we'll see. Okay, I'm gonna shield this because I want my Azumarill to actually survive this. And we should be able to take him down. I think if she uses this, then uh, good for me, I guess. Because his Azumaru is going to go down anyway. Yeah, he's going to block it. Yep, definitely going to block it. Oh crap, I was going <sighs> to... I was going to swap it out to Scizor. That's fine. Okay, so I'm going to use Scizor for this. I'm going to farm him down, should be fine, yep, okay. So unless he has a fire type, my scissor is, is just going to get melted. But for the time being, oh, perfect. So this is where, this is what I'm talking about. So uh, I think they use a lot of defense deoxys, right? So Night Slash would do wonders because, well, Night Slash is really powerful against a psychic type Pokemon, like I said. So that's why I decided to use scissor in this matchup. Well, I tried to. And hopefully it does more damage. And to be honest, Night, Cla Night Slash actually uh, builds up energy quite fast. And I need to protect my Scizor. Okay. I should be able to take him down after this. I hope it's within range. Okay, cool. Alright. <clears throat> the Ox is down. Last one is Medicham. So. Uh, if Manichan doesn't take me down, which I think he will, I can use my bug skill to take him down. Oh, Ice Punch, Ice Gun. Whoa, Ice Punch is not effective and I still die. Okay, so last one is my Alteria. Alteria should do super effective move. Um, oh my god, it has Ice Beam, right? Oh, Ice Punch. Was it Ice Punch? I forgot. Yeah, Ice Punch. I am so dead. Okay, if I can re get my uh, Sky Attack out, I should be able to kill him. I hope. Come on, come on, just kill him already. Yes, oh, thank god. <laughs> GG guys. Alright, so third match in the bag. I believe so far Scizor is doing okay. It's still a little bit questionable, but uh, I'll swap it out a bit later. You know, once I get a gist of it, you know. This one is gonna be a bit tricky. You don't even know what moveset to use against this. But it's doing so much damage to me right now. This is not even funny. Okay, I gotta swap out my Alola. I need to swap out my Azumarill after this because I am not doing enough damage. Okay, wow. You swap it out first. Mammal Swine. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. I'll just use Play Rough. Incoming attack. Uh, I want to block this. I want to block this. I think Play Rough should do enough damage to take down Mammal Swine. But I think he's going to block. For sure. He's definitely going to block. Yep. But Bubble is actually doing quite a lot of damage. You guys realize that, right? Like, since when Bubble does so much damage to Mammal Swine? Okay, I'm going to let him uh, kill my Azumarill just so that I can uh, use my Alteria to take down uh, Mammal Sun. Uh, I don't need, I can just use Scizor, right? Scizor should be able to do the job, I hope. Come on, stop lagging, stop lagging. Wow! How fast was the charge move? <laughs> okay, the lag really, really affected me because since when the charge move for Avalanche was that quick, right? Okay, so. We are out of shields already. Uh, I'm hoping that. Oh my god. Skarmory is going to kill me right now. Ouch, ouch. I don't think I really have an answer for Skarmory though. I was trying to bait out his shield, but it didn't work. Okay, I think we're going to lose this round. <laughs> Most likely because I was not ready for Skarmory to be honest. Okay, so Alteria, please do some magic. Ah, 
man. Okay. I'm dead. Alright. GG. GG. Alright, last match, guys. Last match. Alright. <clears throat> okay, so Latias. I'm going to swap out to Scizor. Because Scizor should do a lot of damage on Latias. But, um. Yep, it blocked. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so here's the thing. We're gonna use Scizor to like bait out all his shield or something. Um, so hopefully I can like take him down. Okay, well he didn't use his shield so that's fine. That's good for me actually. And Moltres is gonna kill me. So, oh my god, it's not even funny. Wow, guys. So, here's the thing about my team, or at least for Scizor. If you fight against a fire type, you're just gonna get melted. Like, right up. Yeah, but unfortunately. Yeah, okay, it's okay. We have Azumarill, so that should be able to help us control a bit. Does he have Sky Attack or is it a Flamethrower? I... What does it have? Ancient Power. Okay, that's fine. Ancient Power doesn't really do much. So... How fast did he charge his move? Holy shit, man! That's okay, we're gonna use Play Rough and... Okay, why did I just use that? I should have farmed him down. Guys, that was mistake. Like, that was a huge mistake. I shouldn't have used that move. Oh man, now I gotta charge up again. And Slow King, oh my god. You're kidding me. Okay. Well, we're doing decent damage, that's one thing. So, if I can get another play rough out before I die, that would be great, but chances are no, that's not the case. Is this the last Pokemon? I think so. Blizzard. Wow. Shit. That's not good. Because my last one, Alteria, is gonna die from Blizzard. Uh, if I can Dragon Breath him to death, that would be great. If he comes out of another Blizzard, I'm dead. Ah, oh, okay. Thank god. I was just spamming because I, I couldn't afford for him to come out of Blizzard. If he does, I'm, my Alteria is just gonna die. And thank god, we won. What did he block? You guys realize, right? He didn't block. He got a shield left. That's weird. Okay. You know, good for me. Good for me. So, that is three wins out of uh, five. And yeah, I did not get the four wins, which will get us a you know special reward or something. But okay, that's fine. That's good enough for me, too. Okay, so playing rewank. Rank three. Nice. Keep in mind, this is the highest rank I've ever been in the Go Battle League. So, yeah, it's kind of nice. Alright, so we're ranked 3 already and I think that will be it for today's episode. Uh, you guys want to see me play more of this kind of uh, like Go Battle League stuff? Do let me know in the comment section. Maybe I will create a video just separately where I do Go Battle every alternate days or something. Like because it's actually much easier for me to film playing in front of a camera like this. I don't really have to go out and stuff. But if you guys are not really interested in this Go Battle stuff, do let me know as well so that I will only focus more on like vlogging and going out and you know shiny hunting stuff you know things that you guys really enjoy so anyway I hope you guys enjoyed this episode I'll see you guys in the next episode I'm not sure when but I do hope you guys are safe and stay away from crowded area if possible okay catch you guys next time bye